Hello everyone, this is Jody Way Talks yet again for another exciting video. And this time I will be doing a little bit of retro gaming. And we're going to be playing Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Um, as you can tell, this was uh, made in 1997. And we're going to start the game. So... I want to name myself Joe. And I'm going to decide. Yes. Journey back to 1792 and the Transylvanian countryside of Romania. Enjoy it while you can, folks. This is the CGI of 1997. Wonderful CGI, right? Oh, they're supposed to be bats. They're actually butterflies. Loading. So, what we're going to do is we're going to do a little bit of a cheat, because we need to get 45 hearts, technically. But this refreshes every once in a while. Well, not every once in a while, but... But we need to get as many hearts as we can. Crap. Power of Cersei. Okay. But you can get as many hearts as you want. Defeat the main boss. Well, well that's not really the main boss. This uh, is a continuation of Castlevania. Um, Castlevania X. So we're just. Re technically, what we're doing right now is we're replaying the main scene. Or the last uh, part of the last game. And basically we're just getting all the hearts we can. Yeah. 
Here we go. I think I got in our hearts for right now. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world! It was not by my hand that I'm once again given flesh. I was called here by... The voice acting is so cheesy, who is isn't it? ...who is to pay me tribute. Tribute? You steal men's souls and make them your slaves. Perhaps the same could be said of all religions. Your words are as empty as your soul. Mankind ill needs a savior such as you. What is a man? A miserable little pile of secrets. But enough talk. How about you? So? Please don't step on me, 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 please don't step on me. Oh crap. Oh well. He's dead. No! This cannot be! Ah! Well, that's how you defeat the main boss. Um. It's literally impossible not to actually die in this part. It's just a walkthrough. It was Richard Belmont, the legendary vampire hunter, who succeeded in finally ending the, ending the menace of Count Dracula, lord of the vampires who had been brought back by the grave by the dark priest shaft. However, one night four years later, under the glare of a full moon, Richter mysteriously vanished. With no idea where to begin, her search, Maria Renard sent out to look for him. It was then that faith intervened. Castlevania, the Dra Castle of Dracula, which is rumored to appear once every century, suddenly materialized from out of the mist as to, sh if to show her the way. Meanwhile, powerful forces were struggling for the soul of a man named Alucard, the very same Alucard who had teamed up with Trevor Balmont to battle his immortal father, Count Vlad Tepes Dracula. Alucard, in order to pur purge the world of his own cursed bloodline, had submerged his vampiric powers and entered what was supposedly to be the eternal slumber, but now he is awake and aware of the evil once more in his homeland. The time has once, has once come again for the forces of good and evil to engage in their ancient battle. Dracula's castle beckons for him, and no man can say who shall emerge victorious. This is a classic game. So classic. Okay, pass the drawbridge.
zombies. experience right now next experience is 50 and gold 51 so I could easily defeat these zombies and have level up some more which is recommended actually because they give you money So, we get to meet Death. Ah, <laughs> uh, Alucard. What is your business here? I've come to put an end to this. Still befriending mortals. I'll not ask you to return to our side, but I demand you cease your attack. I will not. not. You shall regret those words. We will meet again. And he loses all his stuff. <laughs> so basically, at this point uh, of the game, uh, the objective is to get all your stuff back and um, defeat the main boss, Dracula. So basically, we have nothing. Yep, we have nothing. We have... Um... And very low stats. So... Our objective is to find a weapon. And we can easily get that right now. So, we got a weapon. And we have another weapon. You can choose between uh, the Red Rust, but Red Rust is a uh, two-handed sword. So, obviously, with two-handed swords, you're um, not going to have enough to hand. And it's slower, obviously. Let's see. 
Now we have to find that. So. And here's our save point, which is kind of cool. So at this point in the game, I am going to pause it right now, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.